bad sounds Smell delicious mm. Beat love, beat love, beat love three times Make sure you like, share, and subscribe Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, y'all. Today, I have a special guest. I have T with me. And you guys, I'm gonna tell, let T um, tell you guys about what she does. We gonna chop it up and everything, but I'm gonna let y'all know how I met T, but I'm gonna say grace first, and then we gonna get it in. So let's bow our heads. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for this food that we're about to receive. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Amen. And say amen again for the people in the back. Amen. Okay. Amen. 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 Anyways, y'all, I'm gonna say, this, like T, I, those of y'all that know Mariah, Mariah is like a sister to me, but T and her met in high school. Well, it was in high school? Yeah, high school. And they are like best, best friends. Almost like sisters. Yes, really, yes, I can yes. say sisters. Because they've been knowing each other over 30 years. Like, that's a long time. You making me feel old? <laughs> I know. I know. It's crazy. Because I'm, I'm like, not. man. <laughs> it's crazy. But um, they have been inseparable. And they either like a day a day apart, right? Yeah, our birthdays are a day apart. That is crazy. And we and try to celebrate it together every year. Y'all do. Y'all yeah. do. They be trying to get up together. And they they ain't missed the beat. I'm, as far as their friendship and everything, they are really, really good friends. And like, like I, they sisters. Yes, if you ask me, they sisters. Yes, but anyways, I'm a, we gonna eat. Chop we gonna it up. snack. We yes, really snack. Yeah, yeah. She has some chips and snack. stuff, and I have watermelon. But anyways, I had them over here. How how you enjoying yourself? I have had the best time ever. I like it. I have had the best, and, and basically we just we just been like hanging out, laughing, mm -hmm. chilling. Mm -hmm. But it has been. Let me tell you this. Me and my husband went to New Orleans. I've had more fun here. What? Yes. I'm telling y'all, yes. it's we been. It's like we got couples here, mm -hmm. and we just been chopping it up, having fun, eating, been in the pool, and everything. So it has been really, really nice, y'all. Really, really nice, and we ain't got no kids here either. <laughs> yes, so that's refreshing. Yes, I love that's my baby. Though. Yes, <laughs> yes, we love the babies. Mm -hmm. So, T's gonna. So, I'm gonna ask you about your business. Okay. Now you went to the um, decorating, party event planning. planning. Yeah. Okay. Event planning. So, how did you get into that? So, I have a passion for it. Mm -hmm. Like all my life. Well, not all my life, mm -hmm. but since I've gotten older, I would just plan everything, family mm -hmm. events, and it was like natural to me. At first, it would kind of work my nerves because the family would be like, oh, well, T, you can do it. Right. T, you can do it. <laughs> T, you can do it. But uh, I did it naturally. Right. I was actually, had my degree in human services, mm -hmm. and I was working in that, in, in that field for a long time, and I liked it because I was able to like service children, mm -hmm. but it was not my true passion. And so I thought about it and I was like, you know, that's not, it's not healthy and it's not even fair when you're in a field mm -hmm. that's not your true passion. Yeah. And so I just went for ventured it. Out and went, I um, just ventured out, mm -hmm. opened up my own business, okay. Nikita's Napery and Events. Okay. I know it sounds weird, but Napery is just, um, it's just a fancy term for table linen. So how did you, I mean, how did you come up with that name? I mean, what made you say, let me just name it that, like. So my middle name is Nikita. Okay. My middle name is Nikita. Okay. And it just, to me, it just flowed. Nikita's napery. Okay. Okay. So that's how I came up with it. Hmm. I always have to explain it though, because a lot of people is like, napery? I'm actually the uh, event coordinator at a college right now. Mm hmm Um. And also, I have my own business. So, what do you? Business. So, how do you feel when you? Um, okay, at your college, at the college that you work at, are, is it easy to do the plan event planning, or is mm -hmm. it kind of challenging? It it can be challenging. We do planning for uh, different students that come in, um, and it's everything from banquets to conferences That's to okay. people speaking. Uh, you know, on the stage mm -hmm. to, um, you know the. Audio visual. Mm -hmm. So I have my hand in all of that because I'm the coordinator. I have to be the one Ooh. to make sure all of that runs well. Um, even on down to like individual speakers, like they'll do breakout work, 
you know, work breakout sessions mm -hmm. and things like that. So all of that has to be in order. So what? Ha so how do you know how to contact whoever? Do you have a Rolodex of a lot of people that contact? So, you know, you know, in the college, mm -hmm. you know, when you're dealing with the college, that's all it's electronic now. Everything okay. is just on the website. You know, we have our particular departments and things like that. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of pretty. <laughs> but I mm -hmm. think so what when you do the um like you decor? Do you do decor too? Is uh you do put somebody over that. Yes. Okay. That's the beauty a decor, of that. I have a decor person. Uh -huh. My main field is the that planning thing. and the coordination. But I do dabble in the decor in that I provide the linens and oh, things okay. like that. So that's an aspect of decor. Mm -hmm. um, but like I said, I do have someone to help me with the decor when it comes to the balloons. Uh huh. And, right, and right, right, like right, right. So yes. Well, you, you don't have to. Do, but my thing is, when you at your doing your business, do you have to do all the decorating? You got you your one person, right? So I'm one person. So like, let's say for example, over the summer I did wedding. In the wedding, there was the decor person. She was a vendor who handled the decor. Okay. But I was the I was the one who made sure, hey, that the wedding went down right, that the people got down the aisle the right way, oh. that the photos were done the right way, the families came together in the right way. I was the one who made sure that happened. That when we got to the reception, mm -hmm. the decor was in place, the catering was in place. Now <laughs> that sounds difficult. I'm gonna tell you, it sounds like a lot of stress. It can because be because what if people are not doing what they're supposed to do as far as the wedding? You know, you tell them to get in line, or they're not there on time, oh, and you happens. have the. So how how do you deal with that? that how happens. did you be like? Do you that happens? I mean, you know, you 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 have to have the the people skills. Of course, you have to have the people skills. For example, I can't give details, of right? Course, but for example, the wedding that. Um, I did over the summer. It wasn't the best man, but it was the best woman and, uh -huh. and she was drunk like from the beginning uh, from the beginning of the way and she came there lit, lit. Drunk. <laughs> And so my assistant, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying? We was like kind of help her, you know First she wobbled down the aisle, but when it came to the reception She was supposed to give a speech the bride and groom told me hey, you know We don't want her to give a speech now. Let this gentleman give the speech. Uh -huh. She cursed us out <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> especially him a little bit towards me but especially uh -huh. him but unfortunately the show had to go on mm -hmm. so i told him okay so and so go ahead do your speech i'll handle her mm -hmm. so i had to just kind of move her to the side let him go do his speech the show must go on you have to have the skills to think on your feet yeah um Be that's quick very way. important because any event that's one of the things something is gonna I don't want to say something is going to go wrong, but you better it's, be prepared. Right. It's not going to be perfect. You, no, yeah. you better have plan A, B, and C mm -hmm, in place. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, that's important. And although it can be stressful, when you're doing what you love, mm -hmm. it's a good stress. Mm -hmm. It's a good stress. So, I mean, no lie. I'm tired at the end of the day. I'm tired at the end of the events. I need to recover. But... Is what I enjoy. But you, so when I get up. But how long it takes? It takes a how about how long to get up an event ready? Like two weeks? You have to plan a month ahead, two months. So okay, so for a corporate event right now, mm -hmm. um, and I kind of view what I do at the college kind of mm -hmm. like as a corporate event. So at a as a corporate event, I have one coming up September fifteenth and sixteenth. We already started. I started in like July, because there's so many aspects of it. We yeah. have to schedule the speakers mm -hmm. we have to get the catering in order and then there's different aspects of catering we may, we may do a banquet we may do a uh, part of it where it's just a mix and mingle we may do um you know just chips because you know college students sometimes they just want pizza yeah so it just depends on what we're doing but this particular event it depends of course on how many people it is um we did an event it was over 300 people so the planning of it happened at least Three months in advance. You have things, you know, we have t-shirts to order. We have gifts and things to order. You have to assemble those bags. You have to have your team to do that. So it takes, uh, depending upon, it takes a substantial amount of time. Now, the wedding that I did, I was the coordinator. Mm -hmm. And I started about six weeks in advance. So it started with me doing the consultations. Mm -hmm. Making sure that I was talking to the bride about what she needed, what she wanted. And then we kind of narrowed those, those meetings down. That's kind of... So we did the, the actual... We did the actual uh, mm -hmm. rehearsal. Uh-huh. 
the day before the wedding and then the day of the wedding it was showtime danger i mean so. i was saying that six weeks that's kind of fast well, you know, when you do a coordination, it's the difference between mm -hmm. planning and coordinating. Okay. When okay. they when they hire you just to coordinate the mm -hmm. wedding, they've done some of their planning, and that's okay. Mm -hmm. Or some brides are like, you know, hey, I don't want to do any of that. I need you to take care of everything. So when it's a planning process, it's much longer. It's a longer process. Okay. Oh, I see what you're saying. Okay. Whereas if it's just a coordination, you're coming in and you're kind of putting it together. What the what the bride and the groom have already done. That's in a wedding situation. Right. So how do people they, they find you? I know you have your web you have a website, right? Nikita's Napery and Events. Hey, wait a minute. What the heck is a Napery? Table linen as tablecloths or napkins. Oh, okay. That's just a fancy way of saying linen. If you have an upcoming holiday party, wedding, birthday celebration, engagement party, or any event, Nikita's Napery has you covered with beautiful tablecloths, chair covers, sashes, napkins, and backdrops for rent to help you beautify your space at affordable prices. We believe that when you have a gathering, you should do it in style and with purpose. So here at Nikita's Napery, we help you to dine exquisitely and celebrate intentionally. For more information or to inquire, please visit our website. And we wish you an exceptional celebration. Yes. Okay, so but is there any other places they, they, they can find you or people they can, can contact find, you? Yes, they can find me on Facebook. Mm -hmm. and it's Nikita's Napier and Events. And you can also call 708-638-7975 for Nikita's Napier and Events. And I'm going to have all the information in my description box. But I was asking that because I'm like, do you, when you, when people call and ask for you, do you ever say, how did you find us? Where did that, you that's find absolutely. Us? Yeah. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, that's on one of our contact pages. Uh -huh. uh, I always want to know that. I want to yeah. know what's the best means for, for you know, from my yep. referrals, exactly. what's working for my business. Exactly. So, absolutely. That's absolutely. good. That's good. So, I'm thinking like, okay, so you got this down pack now. So, how long you been doing? How long have you been like officially in business? Like, Okay, officially in business, I would say officially, officially, maybe three years. Like many people, I started during the pandemic. Mm. I started, but... Mm -hmm. It was funny. I was blessed to do small, you know, mm -hmm. little things during those times. Get your but, practice in. Uh, yes, mm -hmm. get my practice in. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I started during the pandemic, but things began to pick up um, afterwards and even now. So, I'm good. <laughs> I'm excited. So, was you was you very nervous on your big, big one? What's the biggest, so, um, biggest one you have had your event? And so I just did a big wedding, mm -hmm. like I said. Mm -hmm. um, it was about maybe 200 people. But the corporate event on the side of the college, it was at least three to 350. So what my thing is, okay, so who is helping you? That's what I want to know. <laughs> who is this group that you do got together to help you with this stuff? Because I know so you I have a team. Like so, you know... There's the college portion of what I do, the mm -hmm. corporate end, and then there's my business. Mm -hmm. And I have a team. What I normally do is there's a, there's a, a team of people that help me with my business. Started off with family members. How many of us do that? Okay. Family, family and friends. And, and the corporate side of it, because I am the coordinator mm -hmm. at that college, they uh -huh. already have my team in place there right. that mm -hmm. help me mm -hmm. with those events. And it's a whole hospitality team. Mm -hmm. So, with what what part would you say is easy? Is it easier running your business or easier running at corporate when you at your job? Because you get all the help mm -hmm. and hands. Mm -mm 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 -mm. <laughs> both of them. Both of them. Um, I would say the business can be a little bit more challenging because you have the service part of it. And then you have the business part of it. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to kind of be on top of the business portion of it. And, you know, I'm just, I'm getting the hang of, of doing those things. Uh -huh. Because I would say the easy part is when I'm in action, when I'm actually doing the service. I love that part. Mm -hmm. So the challenging part is me, hey, T, you know, hey, sit down. Get those books in order. You know, do the things that you need to do. Yeah, the business. So, okay. Yeah. So okay. I would say the business. Okay. 
Because I'm thinking, so when you, you don't, you do, do you do the catering? How do you, you call so, it the catering? I, yes, I will have um, specific vendors. That okay. I work with okay. Me. Okay. So, I, okay. Yeah. All things events, baby. Events provide us a way to honor each other. Mm -hmm. It provides, I mean, on a on the the to celebrate each other. Mm -hmm. You know, just on a regular end with the weddings, with the birthday parties. Um, they enrich our lives. I'm so that's one of the things that I personally love about events. The you know the corporate side. Hey, what are we doing? Mm -hmm. We're building our skills. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We're uh, making connections. We're making um, you know professional connections. And uh, we're informing each other. So yeah. all things events, baby, it's, it's wonderful to me. And I know because I'm I'm telling y'all, if y'all have ever see, I hang with them, and even with her family, it is so fun. Uh, <laughs> she is so, she's a bubbly personality. I know like that right now. It's her first time being on mm -hmm. camera and everything. She's doing you doing pretty good. Thank you. You doing pretty good, but she is a character her and her husband oh i'm telling God. you they are so fun and so sweet so so sweet so y'all i'm telling y'all y'all need to check out her business and everything and i feel that um that's probably why you so because i mean when you have an event like that you bring people together mm -hmm. laughter and mm -hmm. fun and it's, mm -hmm. it's good for the mm -hmm. soul it is so i be thinking like i'm like that's a good thing that you you know mm -hmm. you get involved in i love it like i said events they enrich you in some form of fashion and i like the fact that your husband is very knowledgeable in that too, as far oh as the video, God. videography and yes. stuff like that. I, I couldn't do what I do without him. Mm -hmm. um, shout out to my baby. I know that's right. Shout out to my Wayne, of course. So I couldn't do what I do without him. He is the editor extraordinaire. You guys, he's also, you know, bringing his expertise to my business. Um, he will also provide those, those um, the editing. Mm -hmm. He will provide uh, montages and anything. Video. Do you see that? So, because when I heard y'all, um, when you y'all told me about your business and the things that y'all was gonna do as far, it's really big. I mean, the expansion of it as far as what y'all oh want to do, God. the things that they want to do in the future, oh like God. really, yes. it's like big, yes. big. And yes. I said that's that's really good. Yes. And y'all, they've been to a little background. They've been uh, married for they only 25, 25 years, 25 years right? Five years old. Next year, y'all, and they're gonna be years. celebrating it. Oh, we gonna be celebrating with them yes, in Jamaica. Baby. Yes, yes, in yes. Jamaica, y'all. So that's that's wonderful. But um, yeah. So I think that I wish you all the best for your business oh and everything. I know the blessings of God, blessing of God is upon your business, Thank you. and I just pray for Thank expansion because I know yes. you're ready for that. <laughs> I know that's right. You're ready for that expansion. Yes. <laughs> but anyways, y'all, yes. I am going to um, leave all her information down below, and I know you are you on IG too, right? You got an Instagram, I am but on IG. Okay, yeah. So we gonna leave all the information. In the description box down below, you guys go check her out. And what what areas do you serve service? Okay, Chicago land area primarily. I am very open to doing um, Indiana, mm -hmm. Wisconsin, mm. and neighboring states as well. So you travel? I will travel. That's I uh, know. <laughs> You travel for an extra fee? Cause, uh, for <laughs> girl, that gas ain't no joke. Yeah, because I'm doing a lot. I'm already doing the corporate side but, and the other side. But, but, yeah, but when you do travel, y'all know I just got questions. When you do travel, you have a truck. Uh, how do you get that form of transportation? So, yes, like uh, me and my husband did kind of purchase a vehicle when we went, we went to purchase one. Just because oh. I had that in mind, that I would have to transport something. Mm -hmm. Sometimes that may not be the case mm -hmm. because I can... Um, contract for different things sometimes it can be just the I, and i also just rent like if you don't need linen if you don't need services like planning or coordination i also just rent so if you just want me to beautify your event and provide the linens the tablecloths mm -hmm. the chair covers we do that too it's okay i try to cover Try to cover you. So you have stuff you on your on your website. You do have things of the, the events, some pictures mm -hmm. and stuff like I that. I have some are... pictures. It is not the extension of my inventory mm -hmm. by any means, mm -hmm. but I do have some pictures. Okay. And we work with you. Of course, we work with you. We mm -hmm. want to make sure that your that is event is good, exquisite. Mm -hmm. Okay, exquisite. Okay, exquisite. <laughs> so yeah, you know, it's called. This is my uh, my slogan. It's dying. Exquisitely celebrate intentionally. Okay, 
So, well, y'all hear that? Doing. But anyways, y'all, again, check her out. I'm telling y'all, this is good good seed, y'all. Y'all won't be disappointed. And she does things in excellency. So her and her husband. Okay, so you guys go check them out. I'm going to leave all the information down below. And that's what's up, y'all. And that's the end of this video, y'all. Always remember to keep God first in everything yes. that you do each and every day, y'all. But I guess that's the end of this video. I'll see y'all next week. Peace out. Peace, love, hair, greet. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe.